Okay, so, um, the last video where I talked about how I missed out on the Itachi on Bupal for pre-order on Chalice, I just want to say I'm really sorry about the video because the audio was really, really bad. Uh, I was trying to be quiet, but I didn't realize I was that quiet, so I'm really sorry about the last video, but I want to give a big thanks to everyone who's been liking and commenting and subscribing. Because, I mean, I've got, I got three subscribers in the last few days, which I know to some people would be like nothing, but considering I had like four subscribers for the longest time, um, to get three in like a week is like crazy. So thanks to everyone who's been liking and commenting. So I just want to give a quick update on this pop. So, like I mentioned, I was not able to get it on Chalice and I barely missed out, but I, Balliot Toy Lab, this is um, a website that I've gotten Instagram ads for from, and I've considered ordering before, but... I did order the Itachi Anbu from them, and unlike the Chalice Collectibles one, this is a special edition, so if you really care about the special edition sticker, you probably won't want to order this one, but um, I'm fine with the special edition sticker personally, so I was fine with ordering it from them, but you do not get the four commons, you only get the common in the chase, which is actually kind of better for me, and it is only like $15 cheaper than it was for Chalice. But I, I was also able to get free shipping, and I heard some people complaining about the shipping price from Chalice, so maybe a little cheaper, actually, than whatever Chalice's price was with shipping counting. So, if you really want to get this pop and don't really care about the sticker, this is definitely the route I would go. Um, but, um, do your research before you order from a website like this. Like, they seem pretty legit to me, but I don't want to tell people to be ordering from them, especially since I haven't ordered from them before in case they are not legit, but they seem pretty legit, so if you really want to get this pop, this would definitely be a way I would recommend to do it, and they also do have the um, Inosuke Flocked, which I know is a really popular one, they have the Common available and the Chase Bundle for also $75, and I know this is a super popular pop, so if you really want to get it, I would recommend getting it from them, um, they have a bunch of really good pops, um, they have got the like Naruto, Chase Hokage, um, uh, They've got Gara. I ordered two pops. Well, three since one was a bundle. I ordered this one. And they have a bunch of cool anime pops. A ton of good Naruto pops. So, uh, this is definitely a place I would probably recommend. At least off the pops they have on the website. And they seem pretty legit, like I said. I mean, I ordered from them. So, they also, like, they have this pop for pre-order, though, which is a really cool pop. Um, this was the other one I ordered. I ordered the Kakashi Lightning Blend. Unfortunately, since this one is in stock, I'm going to have to wait till the Itachi Anbu comes in to get it, even though it is in stock currently. But I, most places do that, so. And they did have the um, Itachi with Crows for pre-order as well, but it sold out before I could make the purchase. So, and it was also special edition, uh, special edition sticker, so. Uh, since everybody's been really liking the Itachi Anbu videos... I just wanted to mention a place where you could order it if you also missed out on the Chalice Collectibles exclusive one. So, um, thanks for watching. Um, and I also wanted to mention, probably the next three videos are probably going to be, um, I'm just going to say what they are. Um, it's going to be an Attack on Titan reaction because I've watched um, the first four se well, the first three seasons completed and what is currently available the fourth season while they're working on the finishing part of the fourth season. Which I know kind of sounds weird, and it kind of is weird how it's set up, but I'll go more into that on the video. And I'm going to do my um, my predictions for the Hunter Hunter Funko Pops, because I think there is going to be more Hunter Hunter Funko Pops since the Crowlo Pop just came out. And there's been some predicted Funko Pops that would go to Hot Topic. And um, I'm going to go over a Naruto Funko Pop video. And it's going to be over the original Naruto. So, the I think the original Naruto should get Funko Pops, because... Um, like, Dragon Ball has pops for Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Z, and Dragon Ball Super. But I think Naruto should have pops for regular Naruto, because, I mean, there's already Naruto shipping in and Boruto. And I'm going to go into that more on the video. But, yeah, so if any of those videos sound cool to you, um, they should be coming in by, for sure by in the next three weeks. And I'll try to get them up ASAP, but I don't. I would like to kind of spread it out. And I've got a bunch of other cool videos planned. Um... And I'm going to be ordering some more pops and doing some more pop reviews. So, just thanks for all the support on the last few videos. And I guess that's it. <laughs>